Hey guys, it's Diamond from the Oppenheimer Ranch Project on Friday the 13th. We have some amazingly poor news to report. We had a light freeze last night, September 12th. You can see the darkening of the squash here. It may not affect the plants. It didn't get to the core, which is a good thing. Quick update. Ooh, there's a nice little apricot. About to pour the foundation pillars for the timber frame deck. And we had to discuss the logistics of how we're getting a cement truck in here. So we decided it could just pull up here along the side of each of these with a short trough and fill each one. Each one's about a yard of concrete. They're pretty big. There's a lot of cement in there. So I'm gonna have to make sure <coughs> that this is probably cut off. We've moved Top Knot's mobile home. He's now leveling it. Top Knot in the house, this is where it was. I'm gonna have to move some of this stuff in this boulders and maybe cut a road in here for the truck so that they can come in up this road. Now this road has been blocked for months because of irrigation and well hookup. But we got it hooked up! And we now have water throughout the entire property, which is totally awesome. Not quite as awesome as this moldy hat I'm wearing that I just found in the grass. That's pretty awesome. But I'll bring you here into the permaculture orchard to show you some of the freeze damage. Here you can see this acorn squash got hit. Squash did not get hit. Light freeze. Quinoa looks good. Now, this doesn't look so good. A lot of these will continue to grow. But the Navajo pumpkin, that looks fried. So, one of the earliest, shortest grow seasons ever since we've been out here, four years. All the cukes dead, frozen, frozen. There he is, the myth, the man, the top knot. So we had a freeze. And it's a wrap for our summer veg, most of them. Some of these squash couldn't recover. A couple nice little zucchinis. So, let me cut that off. She's a beauty. Probably a black beauty. Look at that. Monolith. Bing. So we've had an early frost, September 12th, which brings our growing season. La first frost, or the last frost, was June 23rd. And through April, I mean through September 12th, gives us exactly 80 days. Here's something that didn't get hit, the arugula. Looking good. This will be our fall arugula bed. We also have some other brassicas coming up, so there's a way to continue to grow food even though it's freezing. You grow cold, hardy crops. Look at this, pepper got, didn't get hit. Amazing. Obviously the kale's not gonna get hit. But winter is coming. Subscribe to the channel. Share this video. It froze in Pagosa on September 12, 2019.